We're Drew Vigari. I'm Priscilla. And that's Chris. And we've been a little bit busy lately. Why? Well, we're building a van. We need to get on the road. Today we've had quite a busy morning. We've been out and we have ordered all the wood that we need for the shower. And we've ordered the wood that we need for the bed. And we got all the pipe fittings that we need for um, putting the shower together. Um, connecting all of that up. So it's been quite a busy morning. We're waiting for the wood now for the guys to phone us so that we can go collect that. Um, so for the time being, we've started on the plumbing. And there were no instructions, so we think we've got it the right way, hopefully. We'll only know once it's all connected. <laughs> so that's going to be fun. Um, but yeah, so today we're going to be finishing up the shower. We're going to be boarding the outside, testing the inside, because I'm still waiting for everything else to arrive on the inside. Let's have a look here. So today we went and bought, what did you get here? So we got elbows. 15 more push, push on fittings. It's just easier. Mm. Um, it's quite, quite clever. It just pushes and locks. Um, but you do have to put an insert in it. Um, and the insert's got a little o ring, so you just need to be careful that you don't nick the o ring. Um, I was. I did see a guy complaining he was having a whole bunch of water leaks online the other day and I believe he cut the earrings. So yeah, you just got to be careful when you push them in. Take the burrs off the pipes when you cut it, you know, and try and cut it as straight as possible. So yeah, now we're going to see, we're going we're gonna to tee the hot and cold water together. Well, that's what we think. So we think this is the hot, so we think that's the cold. And these two are for the switches between the rain shower and the hand shower. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Hopefully. But I'm going to tee the hot and the cold together and run, run one pipe to the back where we'll have our gas water heater um, and then we'll regulate the temperature there. Um, it's just easier then we don't have to have two pumps and... For hot and for cold. Hot and cold, yeah. Because yeah. we'll probably use more water like that as well. Um, so also, I think this thing's going to use a lot more water than... We anticipated, <laughs> but we'll have to just take it one step at a time. I saw the shower, I wanted the shower, I don't care how much water it's going to use, it looks pretty, and that's all that matters. Hey, pretty is key. <laughs> so, so. <laughs> so, tune into another video where Chris had to retrofit the shower to a new <laughs> shower. Oh, so. Low water, pressure. Low pressure water consumption <laughs> shower. But that's in probably about 15 to 20 videos. <laughs> Listen, you just keep quiet. Here's the toilet. <laughs> it's a short drop. It's a short drop. Alright, so now we need to cut some more pop. Mm. A piece uh, maybe like 60 long. Yeah, you're doing that yourself. Oh, am I? Yes, because okay. just now you should have to act for uh, who, cutting it 40 instead of 60. Oh, right. Well, Why can't you measure? instead of 40. <laughs> just pushes and locks in like that. Quite simple. Okay. Well, it's done now. You can't take it out. <laughs> and it just pushes in the next one. Yeah. Is that it? That's it. Sorted. Yeah. Hmm. That's a whole lot easier. Yeah. So now we need to drill a hole, yeah. Right, so uh, 
I made it into the car. Yes, we are in the car. Uh, we managed to get all the wood in, which is good. The wood shop is literally just around the, house, the corner from our house, so it's not too far from us. Um, and the guy's like, listen, come back tomorrow. Please consider subscribing, it really helps us out. See you in the next one.